This is the ETBU Sportsnet Coaches Show. I'm here with head cross-country coach Natalie Buckprather. Coach, uh, I just found out a few minutes ago you're actually taking two runners to regionals. You're taking both Shelby's and Shelby Taylor Spencer and Shelby Sparks. Uh, why don't you uh, give us a preview of what to expect this Saturday in Mount Berry? Yeah, we're excited. Both of these are senior girls. They have both qualified for regionals three years in a row now. Um, so I'm excited to get to take both of them in to this course. They actually ran this course two years ago, so they know what to expect. They, they're they familiar with the terrain and they're familiar with the competition. So I'm excited because they both had, well, Shelby uh, Taylor Spencer had an awesome race two weeks ago, and I think that she's going to do really well at regionals. Um, Shelby Sparks is, she didn't get to run due to a family, um, a family tragedy, but I think that she's going to enjoy, this will be her last college race, and so she will get to have one more race as a collegiate um, athlete and I'm excited for both of them. Uh, Coach um, you've managed to continue to improve in times uh, for cross country over the years you can continue but uh, recap the season in general how you think uh, you would evaluate it. I, You know I was really pleased you know overall team wise we didn't place um, as high as we have had in pre previous years, but I'm okay with that because we actually had a really young team, freshmen on both the men and women's side. Uh, but if you compare times for the last five and six years, um, really in the last, since 08, um, since I, I took over the program as the time, each year the times have improved and by far this year, we have had some of the best times, especially on our women's side. Um, Shelby Taylor Spencer has broken yet again all of the records, of course, all of them being her records. Um, but it's exciting to be able to see a senior who can still pull out, um, you know, personal records. And we've, we've seen that all year long. And of course, all of our freshmen have improved. Um, so overall, the times have, have been great. And I, I think looking forward for the next couple of years, we're going to see some good stuff happening here. With that in mind, uh, as you look ahead to next season, uh, what can we expect? I know this team was a young team, but hopefully uh, more improvement, but also an opportunity to get some more recruits in. Uh, what can you tell all future college recruits that are watching uh, this? Um, well, we, we will have a strong base for next year, um, but going into next year, we do have a lot of new runners that are looking in at the program. Um, and so there's a lot of opportunities here because the program is growing. We are getting better overall with times. The, the workouts, we're able to put more mileage. We're healthier. Um, overall, it's just a lot stronger. Each year we get stronger, and this is by far the best. So I'm excited about the recruits that we have coming in. We We've had a lot of campus visits the last few weeks. Um, we've got several more before Christmas, and I've got some good kids coming in, hopefully in the fall. All right, Coach, thanks for talking to us on the ETB Sportsnet.